This is about Viking sunstones. How to use them, what stones to use, and where to get them. Now this is a piece of optical calcite from Hunan province in China. The Vikings used Icelandic spar, but you can't get it anymore. The spar fields are protected. This is about two inches by two inches by one inch. So um, any smaller than that, it's very difficult to use. Sunrise. I'm going to test an Icelandic spar crystal. How they work as a sunstone. And get out of the direct sun because it will affect the crystal. So there we go. Up on the upper right hand side you'll see two dots. Now this side here, that's our reference side, that will point directly to the sun at sunrise when we align to it. You'll see two dots as we come round to the east. One will fade, then it'll come back, then the other will fade and come back. The reference side is now pointing south. Between the two fade outs where the dots are equal that points directly to the sun. That reference edge points directly to the sunrise. All the gemstone mentioned in this video can be bought on eBay for a fairly reasonable price. There were two other sunstones in common use in Europe. Brown shawl from around the Drava River in Austria and Slovenia. It's also found in Saxony from the Ore Hill there. And the other's iolite. There's not much iolite left in Europe. It's mined out. It works well. I've got a necklace. Thor's hammer. The stone in that is iolite. I'll show you how to use it later. This brown shawl from the Drava River in Austria and Slovenia. That crystal's oriented north-south. Now as I turn to the rising sun, that crystal will darken because it's a sunstone. And go right the way around until it's pointing north-south again. The sun's at elevation 30 degrees at the moment and that's about the limit to what these things are capable of working at. If you go higher than 30 degrees, the sunstone function stops working. I had to wait this long because brown shawl is such a dark stone that this little camera phone won't pick up the subtleties, the changes of the colour of it the human eye will pick up. Anyway, I think it's shown it. You see it change colour? Purple. Yellow. Light, picking up the sun over the horizon. It's a sunstone. Now 
this is my Thor's hammer mounted up the front of it is an eyelight crystal at the moment that crystal's oriented north south now turn it to face the rising sun it'll darken now we'll turn it back north south again lightens up now how do you use these things well watch this There's the rising sun. There's the Thor's hammer pointing straight to it. There are those little nicks in the side. I put them under the equinox. If you line up that dot at the point with that nick on the side, that gives you the bearing. of the celestial north. That's how they use it.